Hi. Uh. <laughs> Awkward way to start. The fuck. I stopped being nice to people the moment I realized I wasn't worth shit to no one, except myself. No, people might think, "Oh, you're you're selfish as fuck for thinking that." Sure, whatever you want me to be. But it comes down at the end of the day, we're filled with a world of negativity, a world of evil, a world of hatred. And the only way we can get out of that hatred is with ourselves. Yes, our own hate comes within, but at the same time, sometimes ill is also on the outside. Like, we don't even have to try. You don't even have to try and you can get hated for no reason. Me, for example, I get hatred for the simplest things. Dealing with racism, not even just on TikTok, outside of TikTok, my whole fucking life, basically. Dealing with bullies, dealing, and I, yes, even though I'm a grown ass woman, it still happens. Yes, I'm saying I'm a woman, for all those who are calling me a tranny out there, being transphobic as fuck because I'm wanting to transition next year, yeah, you can go fuck yourself. My whole point is I know I'm still a woman, at least I know what I'm born as, like I can accept the fact that I am a fucking female, even though technically I was born intersex, but that's another story for another day. Regardless, my whole point is it sucks to live in a world where we can't afford housing, we aren't allowed to smile unless it's on a trendy base, like if it's trendy. We're not allowed to be ourselves unless we are like everybody else. We have to be fucking sheeps or followers or goats or fucking robots into the working society. We have to be people that we're not just to make others happy. I refuse to be everything that everyone wants me to be and hates me for being. People hate me for being black. That's racism. People hate me for being a woman. That's sexism. People hate me for being tall. What the fuck is wrong with you? Just like how you all little boys and little fucking men talk about, oh, we can't control height. Oh, women always want to worry about height and shit. We can't control our height. Bitch, I can't control my height either. Leave me the fuck alone. Like, I don't want to be bothered by you. I like women anyways more than men. Yes, I'm pansexual, but that don't, that's not even the fucking part of the story. That's not the point. Like, I like people in general. As long as you can fucking respect me and see me as a human being, not as a fucking tool to your little chessboard, then we're good. If you're not on my fucking list of good people, Fuck off. Like, if you're gonna be treating me like if I'm a fucking piece of metal thrown onto a dartboard, get out of my life. It's simple. It's that fucking simple. It's tiring. It's tiring. I'm just... I'm so tired on trying to live in a world within a stupid country, by the way. Yes, America is stupid. All y'all little blue lives matter, all lives matter, and bullshit, bullshit, bullshit of constant, oh, America. I like, motherfucker, like, I don't care. Cock call your ass somewhere else. Get your fucking big ass head out the way. I would like to get to my goals and my dreams of my life. I would like to live as a human being freely. In a country that's not even free. It's never been free in the first place. This country's not free. It's not fucking free, bro. Whoever believes that this shit is free, you are so brainwashed. I don't care if my hair looks crazy. I don't care. People will call you crazy for being you. People will call you crazy for being, like, you know, to yourself, being quiet. People will call you crazy for just existing. Everyone normalizes the weird, disturbing shit these days instead of actually being normal. And normal becomes, literally, it's detrimental. It's literally a myth at this point because nothing's normal. People that say, oh, why aren't you normal? Why are you so weird? Why are you an NPC? Bitch, if I wanted to be normal, guess what? I wouldn't be alive. I was never meant to be a normal person. I was never meant to be like everybody else. Why are y'all so obsessed with people being normal? I'm confused. Why are you so obsessed with my genitalia and wanting to know why I want to transition? Why are you so obsessed with hating me for no fucking reason? You're chronically online with no fucking life and you have the audacity to fucking go after someone who has a life who's trying to get their fucking shit together, who's struggling in this crazy ass patriarchy bullshit of a fucking country. And you're choosing to be chronically online and disrespect them for no reason. You're choosing to literally be on the other side of the spectrum of bullshit, bullshit, bullshit that exists in this damn country, on this damn planet, in this damn world. I'm confused. You're gonna hate me because I don't believe in God. Okay, move on. Not everyone has to believe in your fucking God. 
You're gonna hate me because, oh, I don't like, I don't know, fucking black olives and green olives. Oh my god, the simplest thing and you're so mad. For what? You're gonna hate me because the way I talk. I can't help the way I talk. If you have a problem with it, go seek help at a therapist's fucking office or get psychiatric fucking help because I don't know what else to tell you. You thinking that my talking's that bad and it bothers you that much? Sorry, sweetie. Some people like my talking. Some people like my voice. I actually do say ASMR, by the way, on my channel. People actually like that shit, surprisingly. People actually like my content on other platforms other than this bullshit app. So maybe talk to them and ask them why they like my content, because clearly not everyone hates me. Granted, most of society hates me, but not everybody. Some people actually appreciate me as a human being. Some people actually care. And honestly, I love those who genuinely care and treat me like I'm a fucking person for once in my life. Treat me like I deserve to be alive. Fun fact, I passed away once in my life at 12 years old. By my own hands, trigger warning, by the S word. Somehow I came back to life. I'm not sure how. And supposedly it was a guess. And don't say, oh my God, God saved you. I don't believe in your God. Leave me the fuck alone. My whole thing is, life gave me another chance for some reason. To find a purpose, I guess. I would assume, I would assume. For anyone who is watching this. If you are that person that gets offended with everything I've said in this video, then you're the fucking problem. If you, if you are that offended, I don't want to tell you. Bye.